Hello, everybody. This is Di Antinatalist, and this is my final um, painting for my class, <clears throat> art class. <clears throat> and um, um, this this fellow, he was a live model, and um, <laughs> unfortunately, my painting doesn't quite do him justice. Um, he was a very good-looking guy very well dressed and very poised and he was somebody that you know i don't see much of around these parts and um you know so anyway i have a couple of hours more to finish some spots on the painting my teacher loved the piece nevertheless I think it's one of the more comprehensive paintings in the class. I think it um, is more developed than anybody's in the class and looks more like him. But my teacher said that he wanted me to work on a couple of areas to get them, you know, a little more correct and um, before I was graded. So I think that's a good sign. I think that he really wanted me to excel and he says diane you've come a long way he says it's it's definite that you've got talent and i hope you keep painting after the class is over so um um this is um you know, it's 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 almost finished. It's it's not going to look a whole lot different. But my teacher really really liked the hair and the forehead. Um, I really think that that's where I also did my 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 very best with him. I think my eyes are really good. I think the actual eyeball looks very much like like Harry. But um, you know, I mean, with experience, it would look even better. It's funny because the model, um, you know, we, we talked a little bit. And I even gave him a Christmas card. I really, really liked Harry. And it's a shame that, you know, some people in your lives, they come and go so fast. And some people, they stick around and you kind of wish that they would mosey on. But, yeah, I really wish I had more interaction with, with this fellow. And... Um, he was sweet, he was kind, professional, he was patient, and he just seemed like such a caring person. And unfortunately, it was in a circumstance where he was just sitting still, um, barely communicating except during breaks. Um, he would set an alarm for his break, um, and the class is four hours long, so this is a result of 12 hours of painting work and I'll probably put two more hours um, into it um, to, to wrap it up. Um, I really liked how I first initiated the drawing and the teacher finally did demonstrate some pointers to us, which I used on this painting. So I started off with the, um, um, the shirt, the tie and the sweater. So, yeah, um, you know, sometimes in life, the people that just, that are in passing, you wish you knew even longer. I mean, I would just love to sit down with with him and have had lunch and tea, um, herbal tea, that is. I don't like any form of tea um, or a Coca-Cola, Diet Coke. But anyway, um, he lives in a different part. He lives about 40 minutes, I think, away from me, but... And I, I suppose I'll probably never see him unless it's in the, the, the school. Um, if I do continue taking classes, I'll probably run into him. And I'm guessing he was around 74. It could be earlier. Uh, it could be younger. I don't know. But anyway, um, yeah, um, it was magical. I really loved drawing him. I really liked him as a, a subject. So, um, and he looks far better than my painting does. Um, he was bragging about the hair. He says, Diane, he goes, you gave me more hair. You look, made me look younger. But, um, 
until he said that, I really didn't realize. I mean, he did have about the same amount of hair. I think my painting just makes it look more brilliant and alive and puffy or thicker or something. But anyway, um, um, yeah, it's, it's a shame that <laughs> of all the people that cross my paths in this city, uh, and most of them, you know, are uh, just total losers and regrettable. I mean, so many, me so many regrets about the likenesses of people here and the, the lack of quality of people in my city and the lack of sophistication and um, the lack of empathy and... Um, yeah, unfortunately, my city is full of very coarse and loud and unsophisticated people. But Harry was definitely not any of those types. And unfortunately, he was a person in passing in my life. So anyway, <laughs> everything comes up to a loss, doesn't it? Everything in life um, ends up being um, a ne negative so, thank you for watching my video.